Many first responders will say they're just doing their job when they save someone's life. But each year, the Detroit Public Safety Foundation recognizes officers it believes have gone above and beyond the call of duty. Today, our Kim DiGiulio caught up with a firefighter who will be honored in a ceremony tomorrow and shares his brave story. It was back in January when this house behind me here on Detroit's west side was up in flames. But thanks to the quick action of Detroit firefighter Desmond Orr, the man who was stuck in that room is now alive. And now Desmond is getting honored for his heroism that day. Desmond Orr is still fairly new to the Detroit Fire Department with eight years under his belt. But at the age of 28, his jacket is starting to become heavy with all of these medals. He's the epitome of what Detroit Fire is about. We're about saving lives. Uh, we're selfless. Chief James Harris says Desmond is a hero every day, but deserves to be honored for his heroic efforts at a fire he responded to last January, running upstairs in this house, which was bursting in flames, knowing there was somebody inside who needed to be saved. He was there on the bed unconscious, picked him up, started dragging him outside. Another firefighter came and assisted me brung them downstairs and after that um, I guess my EMT skills or medical skills started to pop in so gave him some oxygen start wrapping up his wounds for saving a life Desmond Orr will receive a medal of valor he will also receive a purple heart award for responding to a fire early last year in which the building collapsed while he was inside I had a couple injuries and um, it was about seven other guys uh, we all went to the hospital that day a couple injuries but everybody made it out alive so I take that as being okay and while Desmond appreciates the recognition he says he was just doing his job both times it always feels good being honored you know I'm very thankful that they are honoring me um, at the end of the day I'm just doing my job um, and I'm just happy that the man that we did save he survived so at the end of the day that's the reward right there chief Harris says that's the type of people who come to work for the Detroit Fire Department Many more of these selfless firefighters will also be honored in the annual Above and Beyond ceremony. That's it. It's priceless. You give us a million dollars a year, it doesn't compare to saving a life. That award ceremony will take place tomorrow night at the Renaissance Center. Reporting in Detroit, I'm Kim DiGiulio, Local 4. All right, thank you very much, Kim. Fallen Officer Lauren Kortz will also be honored at the ceremony with a posthumous Purple Heart Award. His family will be there to accept the award on his behalf.